Meghan Markle's exclusive gig as the guest editor of the September issue of British Vogue just keeps making headlines. From her exclusive interviews with major public figures like Michelle Obama to the thoughtful profiles of Jane Goodall and Laverne Cox, the issue is full of surprises and special treats for Markle fans and global citizens alike. Still, the project has raised a few eyebrows, and for those who will always find a way to criticize Markle, the Vogue project is an example of the Duchess of Sussex stepping outside the bounds of what is acceptable for a member of the royal family. How did Meghan Markle end up as guest editor for British Vogue? British Vogue is a staple in the world of fashion and entertainment, and their September issue was destined to be a smashing success from the start. Recently, it was revealed that Markle was originally asked to be the cover star for September's British Vogue, but she declined, offering an alternative proposition, to guest edit the magazine. The project was groundbreaking for several reasons. First, Markle is the first guest editor that the publication has had in over 100 years. Markle also spent a great deal of time working on the issue, and it is clearly the largest project that she has worked on since giving birth to her son, Archie Harrison, in early May. While Markle has been doing royal life on her own terms all along, she definitely took the unique opportunity to break another royal precedent, allowing her personal political views to shine through all throughout the issue. The royals typically don't discuss politics. It has long been a function of the royal family that they remain politically neutral. The royals don't traditionally speak out about serious political issues and try to remain very far removed from American politics. There's a reason for this. According to a news article, the royal family, headed by Queen Elizabeth, has to remain politically neutral and separate from elections. They aren't even allowed to vote. While the rules aren't quite as strict for royal family members besides the Queen, they are still obliged to follow her lead in most cases. Markle has made headlines in the past several years due to her strong political convictions. She is a special case within the royal family since she was a public figure prior to marrying Prince Harry, and a celebrity to boot. She has spoken out in the past about her dislike of US President Donald Trump and leans to the political left. Meghan Markle introduced complex issues into the magazine. During her time guest editing British Vogue, Markle worked in plenty of serious issues into a magazine that is primarily rooted in fashion. Edward Enenfeld, the editor-in-chief of the magazine, praised Markle's willingness to tackle tough subjects like mental health, race, and women's empowerment. She also declined to appear as one of the featured subjects on the cover, preferring to spotlight women that are forces for change around the world. Markle also made sure to include a call to action for readers within the magazine, putting a blank mirrored space on the cover that is meant to represent the reader. While some people have expressed displeasure at Markle's socially conscious efforts, it seems unlikely that the royal family will have any problems with the issue. After all, Markle's focus remained on human rights issues rather than strictly political ones like gun control or immigration. Whether or not her bold project could signal a new direction for the entire royal family remains to be seen.